Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to Connor and Jamie doing things so you don't have to. It's been a little while since we've seen you. Jamie's been not well and been keeps backing out of episodes and stuff. Totally not not down to me, not wanting it's to... Totally uh, not Connor. He doesn't to... cry every time Mad Croc's mentioned. It's, it's totally <laughs> not Connor. I'll take the blame for that. Well, I've got PTSD with that one, okay? We're, we're going to have to do it next episode, but... We do keep promising this. I think it is week three of promising. It I don't is. know what's going to go on longer, lockdown or us promising to drink Mad, mad Croc. Both for exactly the same time, and that is eternity. Yeah. We're so, both subconsciously waiting for the yeah. NHS to open back up before we drink it. Yeah, exactly. So <laughs> so that's next episode, but this episode, this, this episode's a special episode for us. We're super, super excited because... Yeah. The, our lovely friends at Razor Wire Energy have sent us out their brand new flavor. This flavor only got released on Twitter last night. Like literally less than 24 hours ago, this was available. We've already got it. We're about to try it for the first time here and tell you whether you should go buy it or not. And the Bring fact that they've sent it out for free means we have to hashtag add it and say go buy it before we tasted it. You should yeah, buy it right now. We've not even tasted it, but it's going to be great. Hashtag sell yeah, out. www.razorwireenergy.com. Go buy it right now. <laughs> exactly. Great drive. Well laid out. Exactly. So, I mean, yeah, do you want to talk a bit, a little bit about Razor Wire, Jamie? Yeah, Razor Wire is a British company, which is always nice. Um, it's nice to support up and coming British companies. It's a bit different to perhaps other products out there that this is developed by a sports nutritionalist. So, it's got vitamins in it. Connor, you Google that later. <laughs> Is that like water and stuff or? <laughs> I, I think there's water in it, but it's got vitamins, baby A, B, C. I hope you've got water in it, Jamie. It's a powder. You're not, <laughs> we're not doing it straight out of the sachet. <laughs> well, this is our first powdered drink. I'm, I've not been trained for this. There's no, there's not even going to be a can thing. I'm, I'm oh, going yeah. out to my comfort zone. We've got no ASMR can opening. Ooh, I know. We're going to have to put that in in post-production of some way. ASMR sure. tub opening next time. Yes, that, that, that could be the replacement. But yeah, they are an up-and-coming entry. They're a couple who develop these drinks. They've got a couple of other brands in different areas. And this one's got vitamins in. It's got antioxidants in. It's only five calories. So this is perhaps your choice of drink. If, like us, you drink energy drinks a lot, but you kind of don't like that kind of saccharin, sugar-free can kind of vibe, and you want yeah. something a little bit more... Um, it's going to make you feel better, make you feel healthier. Yeah, make you feel healthier, make you feel fresher, and I'm really looking forward to trying it because both me and Connor we have experimented with other brands that we I always suppose should mention. We've both tried G Fuel, Sneak, um, we've even tried Respawn, which was on for America, which was yeah. very very different. Yeah, and I don't know about you, Connor, but I find these these flavors and these kind of brands walk a tightrope with certain flavors where yeah. they can get things too wrong because they're too sweet. Or yeah, I think we mentioned artificial. mentioned in an earlier episode about the pineapple one, right? From Razor, uh, not from Razor Wire, from Respawn. Um, it just just didn't hit right. There's something about it, and it they just didn't it didn't click. So we're hoping that this flavor today from Ra Razor Wire is just spot on. We're gonna have to. I mean, it's a sponsored episode and stuff, so go check out Razor Wire. But we're gonna have to compare it to the G Fuels, the Sneaks, the. Oh yeah. There's there's no way we uh, around comparing it to those, and I feel I feel like the people watching who might want to go buy this will probably get more benefit out of us comparing it to those too. And the advantage is, for if you're gonna choose and like this one, obviously the postage fees are not quite as big because they're shipping from the UK. And you don't have to pay thirty dollars like, um, import. <laughs> yeah. So there's no import things, and they do D W D P D. So you can have it next day delivery if you really value what me and Connor have to say and think right that is my next flavor exactly so should, should we jump into the the actual should we begin? Well, we can't do our can opening which is disappointing oh. i'm using the shaker which i uh, was highly provided i Connor's unfortunately left my shaker at the office the jelly media office where me and jamie both work before lockdown I, we, we were, we we're scrambling we ran we left everything <laughs> There's, there's someone still in the office. We we'll have to leave him there and get him back. Poor Jack. I miss Dan. I really do. <laughs> someone should drop some food off at some point. Exactly. So I've got mine in a glass. Today we're doing the apple flavour. It's, it's brand new. They have um, ras. Uh, they have cherry and raspberry. They have cherry and raspberry, both which yep. I'm looking forward to trying very yeah, much. Yeah, I can't I've wait. Got set. Big fan of apple flavour stuff. I know there was a couple of chats on both our social medias. I think it was yesterday about the monster ultra apple flavor and yeah. i've got to say that's 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 a god tier flavor so 
if this gets anywhere close to that, it's going to be rated very, very highly. Exactly. So I'm, I'm a big fan of having ice in my um, powdered energy drinks. I just feel like getting them nice and cold, like, because I feel like that's why I like drinking out of a can a lot of the times, because like the can keeps it like super cold. That's so true. I love to have ice in it, and I would, I would have ice in any other one. So I thought, you know, keep it fair, keep it nice and means testing. So, and I don't, so we can give a full balance to it. Exactly. I don't like ice in my drinks. I even the kind of person that if I'm in a pub and I order a Coke, I don't have ice in it. So we're being honest to ourselves. Should we do the smell test? Smell test, let's go. Let's do this. It smells really good. Oh, that's that actually tastes like fresh fruit juice out of the fridge. It does, yeah, like it, it looks like if you just went to like a Sainsbury's or something and bought like a carton of apple juice or whatever. It does. I kind of like that yeah. about it because it doesn't have that like really lurid green colour you sometimes get with apple drinks. Yeah, yeah, like the well, neon it's green. Like Chernobyl green. <laughs> Chernobyl green. <laughs> like, That's gonna be inside me. <laughs> yeah, should I be drinking that? This actually looks like it's it's ground up apples, which given exactly. it's an apple based drink, is quite good. Exactly. I'll Google apples later as well. See what they are. Yeah, it's a flavour, mate. They don't actually exist in the real world. <laughs> yeah, like red flavour. <laughs> yeah, just Google red fruit flavor, as well. Red flavour, green flavour. Right. right, I mean, I'm, I, want, I want to try some, Jamie. Yeah, I'm... Uh, let's go, let's do let's it. Let's do it. Ooh, that's quite nice, that. Oh, that's nice. That's refreshing, which is not a phrase you often use with energy drinks. Yeah, it honestly just tastes like... If you like it just tastes like apple juice, which is great because I love yeah. apple juice. It doesn't take like it doesn't taste hella powdery. It doesn't taste no, like no hit the powder there. It doesn't really take, like a lot of the a lot of the sort of powdered energy drinks on the market leave that sort of powdery residue aftertaste. Yeah, Even some of the, the most high high powerful brands do. The, exactly. The you think. And I made this about twenty minutes ago. I've not shook it that much since I made it, and it's still holding its. Yeah, well, that's I, mine's in a glass too. So like, obviously, I shook it before I put it into the glass, but obviously, it's been sat in there. And there's no no like residue or anything. No aftertaste as well. I think. Well, no bad aftertaste. It's yeah. just refreshing. It 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 tastes like sweet apple juice. If I'm absolutely honest. Yeah, honestly, like I, I I go to Sainsbury's a lot. I buy the one pound Sainsbury's own apple juice. That if that was in that, I wouldn't notice the difference. You know what I mean? It's really nice, Ooh. really nice stuff that. And it's, it's, really not very, well. it's not very often I keep going back to drink on the show, but it's, it's no, really kind and really nice. Me who's guilty. I, I usually always try and finish, but <laughs> I really like that. Yeah, I, I actually think that's a good summer <laughs> one. That really is a good like drink to drink in the summer. It's refreshing as well. That that has made me so excited to try the raspberry one. Oh, definitely. That's gonna um, that's gonna be so refreshing too. Like it's gonna be. I I love like a raspberry flavor drink. So that's gonna be for me that one. Yeah, I like all those. Blue raspberry is one of my particular favourites. I think that's sneak. So, yeah, I'm very tempted to try that. And the fact it's zero sugar helps massively. Exactly. And cherry. Yeah. Cherry is my all-time favourite flavour. I mean, I really like the, um, again, Cherry Ultra Monster. They are absolutely amazing. I don't think you're as big a fan of cherry, are you? No, I'm... I'm mm, it's very, very hit or miss for me, cherry. Yeah, it's a high-risk flavour, definitely. It is, because if it's done slightly wrong, I'll, it'll be disgusting for me. But, but it's the same with apple, to be fair. If you can, yeah, especially you, with energy you go, drinks. Yeah, you go too much towards that artificial taste, you are absolutely sunk. But this is is really really nice. It is and really I know nice. you'd be sat there thinking they got it for free. The branding's going to be on the thing. But genuinely, we we did chat with the guys and say, look, we we're trying to build something here that is honest and transparent. Yeah. So, but I, I would buy this. In fact, I probably will well, buy this. Well, I wouldn't because he just sent me some for free. Cheers, guys. <laughs> no, <I'm> joking. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and, I mean, and if they do need to send more for free, then we, we will test it rigorously. Exactly. We might actually put one of the other flavors on the show in the coming weeks, but yeah, we, we need to give others a chance exactly. as well. But so, yeah, Rares Wire Energy or RWE, that is a quality drink. Big, I'm a big fan. Honestly, a big fan. Yeah, I am. What are you going to give it, it out of 10? Oh, this, that's a question. It is. It's a very, very big question. Do you know what? That, this almost creeps over into... Just a quality drink, never mind energy drink. Yeah, that's that's it's kind that. of like why I'm wondering a bit on my rating here because, I, yeah, it, it, it's sort of weird because it do, I don't feel like I'm drinking an energy drink, so I just feel no. I feel like I'm rating it against apple juice at this point. Like that's how <laughs> good the actual flavor yeah. is. It blended so I get well. What you're I do get what you're saying. 
Like, yeah. Um... I also think, right, when I'm grading stuff, I always think, right, how would I improve it? Or what would I want from it? Or what would I pull it down on? And it tastes great, which is a bus. No sugar, which is fantastic. It's actually got good stuff in it, <laughs> which for those of us who don't always eat the best diets, that'd be me. <laughs> I'll put my hand up there as well, you can't see, but... <laughs> <laughs> You should have had both hands up. Yeah, sure. I, I see your tweets at 6.30 in the morning when you've not gone to bed yet. <laughs> it's got vitamins in it. It's got any toxic. And so I'm not claiming this is good for you. I'm not a doctor. I'm not <laughs> quite at the level of recommending people drink disinfectant. But I'm not a doctor. So, But anything which has got a good bit of healthiness in it has to be a good thing. Exactly. And with the summer coming up, I, I can't fault it. I, I'm going to have to... I want to say nine and a half. I never want to give anything a ten. Oh, wow. That, That's a huge that rating. But nine, nine and a half? See, I'm going to give this an eight and a half, but I feel like the other flavours might go higher for me just because I feel like you're yeah. you're a much bigger fan of apple in general. It's got half so. the point, definitely, because of that apple yeah. flavour. But, but the, the, the cherry could go even higher because I prefer cherry over apple, but I am a big fan of apple drinks. So, yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna give that an eight point five out of ten. Like that is a very, very solid. Like hitting up there with competing with your monster energies, competing with your G fuels and your sneaks for sure. Oh, it definitely earns its place amongst those. And the other thing I would comment on, I was chatting to you the other day about, is if you go on the website and look to buy it, when you get a tub of, I think it's G fuel or sneak, you usually get about thirty-five to forty servings for your price. Actually, with these, it's up to sixty servings. Yeah, that's so that's you're getting at least a third changer, more yeah. for around the same money, plus no import costs, plus um, less delivery costs, pro- plus if you want a next day delivery, you've got that, which you wouldn't get from the states. Probably turning so, out at like yeah. what, like half the price of a G Fuel when you factor in all the extra servings and the import fees and stuff. Definitely, well, it certainly uh, turns down your price per drink, drags it down. Oh uh, yeah, time. massively. So yeah, I mean that's two good ratings there: nine point five out of ten and eight point five out of ten. I'm really looking forward to the raspberry. I, I want to drink the raspberry one right now, but I also want to do it for an episode. So I yes, think I, I think we're going to have to be episode. all disciplined and not drink it. Yeah. I Although I'm not promising I won't drink the cherry one. No, yeah, I think we drink the cherry one off stream because I might I not, might not even like the cherry flavour. And it'll be yeah, a Yeah, no one wants to see Connor cry. So no, yeah, let's not no drink the cherry. So yeah, I mean, I, th- I think that's going to be the end of the episode. Um, Congratulations, RWE, but tune in next week where Connor will drink Mad Croc. <laughs> yes, Mad Croc is going to be the next episode, guys. Like, I've literally got the can right here. Um, so have I. I'm going to reach around as he smashes himself into this, the This is going to be the next episode. It's going to be Mad Croc. It's, yeah. um, spoiler alert, there will be tears. Oh, there will. We, we drank this on our pilot episode when we were kind of like testing the format. I say pilot episode, it's the episode where Connor forgot to turn the camera on, so we never actually recorded it. <laughs> but, and, and that was the Mad Crop with sugar in, and it was genuinely disgusting. And we're yeah. actually quite disappointed we lost that episode because that drink yeah. was horrific. And now we've got it sugar free. The only thing dragging so, it to a one out of ten was the sugar. Yeah, so we are both very fearful of it. I've got. We've had these cans now around two and a half weeks. Yeah, at least, at least. But and yeah, we so, find reasons not to oh, drink yeah. it. Oh yeah, I've been ill for two weeks just thinking about it. Yeah, every time we've got to film it, and um, Connor handles the can, <laughs> he, he goes green. So yeah, <laughs> tune in next time for Mad Croc, but do check out www.razorwireenergy.com and yeah. I've got to recommend the apple flavour. Fresh out today, exclusive from us, and we... Exclusive from us. <laughs> this should, this should be the first review you guys ever see for this this drink. This will be, And th- in a few years' time, when, when they're bigger than G Fuel, people will be coming to this video to see what the early pundits had to say. And, oh, yeah. And obviously, just like, a, again, like, a, obviously, this is a sponsored episode, So, um, but we've been transparent. We're not, we're not making this up. We are going to... I'm going to have another swig now. It's really good stuff. We're going to finish them. And we've got a few sachets that we're definitely going to drink and do again on stream because we do like the product. And just a massive thank you to the guys at Razorwire for believing in us, liking our content, and wanting to let people see their products. So, yeah, we will uh, see you all guys next week with Mad Croc. Cheers for watching, guys. guys. Bye. Bye.